Good morning, modern steaders. It's kind of a weird morning out this morning. It's cold and eerie feeling. Let me show you these. All the caterpillar nests are showing up pretty good in the trees this morning. There's some of those back trees. Good morning, sausage. Stay tuned to the end of the video and I am going to announce the three winners for the 40,000 subscriber giveaway. Right there. You nibble there for a minute and let me get your... Oh. I almost went for a ride this morning. That would not have been a good way to start the day. I'm glad I didn't fall. It's nice seeing the chicks out. You settling in better over here, Andy? You got your popcorn money for popcorn? Yes. You all ready for your spelling test today? Yes. Have a good day at school. Okay. Love you. Love you. Bye. Got the outdoor goat lighting installed yesterday. If you didn't see that video, I'll put a link to it right here. Those chickens love hanging out in that one spot. Look at the fog over there. It's pretty neat. I think we see some green coming up in the pasture. Morning. Listen, Willow. No goat farts today, okay? No goat farts. We got that too close to the wall. There, I like that. in the old boot. <sighs> what are you gonna do with all those apples are almost all gone. So this should be the drone. Finally got it back from GoPro. Exciting, been missing flying it, that's for sure. Did I glue it shut? Holy moly! Oh. I guess I had it upside down. Nope. We got a new drone. I guess that was kind of a tease though, because we're not going to be flying the drone right this minute. I'm going to have to call GoPro and get that all set up. But for now, I'm a little OCD. The other day we painted that door and it looks awesome. But the trim, not so hot. Not only that though, it kind of makes that door just look blah. So I think we might have enough paint to paint this door. And then also, Gina doesn't know about this. I hid this on her. I got some white paint to do the trim on both the doors.
Hope I don't regret doing this. They press into this groove right here. I figure it's gonna be a lot easier to do that than this to mask off the weather seal. I'll put it in fast forward so you don't gotta watch me roll the door out in real time. I just take way too long. Now the other door took about is it three coats. I will see how many coats this one takes. While the coat of paint on the door dries, I'm gonna try to get a coat of paint on the trim. Now Gina has no idea that I'm doing any of this. So I'm hoping she wants this door cranberry. And if she doesn't, then she's gonna have a cranberry door anyway. I know watching somebody paint can be pretty boring, so we'll be right back. The weather strips went back in nice and easy. I'm glad I took them out and didn't try masking them. And a nice boneless ham from our winter pigs that we raised. Gonna cook it fat side up, that way when it's cooking, all that fat's gonna melt and go right into the meat and give it some awesome flavor. Some dried onion on it. A little bit of garlic powder, then some salt. What are you doing, mister? Huh, Pluto, get in the house, come on. Get in. Get in. I gotta go pick Olivia up from the school bus. Let's see what she thinks about the door. Look at Andy hanging out on the trailer hitch. Door. You noticed it. Yeah, why did you? I don't know, why not? To surprise you and mom. How was Popcorn Friday? Good. I was wondering how fast you would notice the door. I saw it right away. You think mom will notice it that fast? Maybe. No, she probably drives it and then she'll probably notice uh -uh. it. Turn around, how's that look? Do you know what I'm talking about? Do you know what I did? No. I painted the trim. No, you didn't. Yeah. No, you didn't. I did too. No, you did not. Alright, let's go fly the drone. Since we finally got it back. Yes. And let's see how the grass is coming in, in the pasture. Well, the drone wasn't picking up what I wanted to show you all. It was showing us where it all washed out in the ruts, but it wasn't showing you this. Look at all the grass growing. I don't know why the GoPro camera wasn't picking that up. It's starting to grow in down here too. funny because you can see where it got washed and all the seeds started to pile up but it's a lot better than I thought it was going to be you're snorting there a little bit you out of shape where's Lynx he's trailing behind you Crazy pigs. Mm. It'll be quiet here without them. Not that quiet. We still have moose. Oh, moose will make up for them. Yeah. Oh, moose. Hey, 
Andy's been quiet. Mm, he's always been quiet. Oh, are you gonna catch it? Yeah, I got it. Ew. Ew. I just stepped on an egg. Ew. Who laid that egg there? Maybe huh? her. You're not supposed to lay your eggs there. They've been nice and clean, huh? Oh, they're going to come over and eat it now. Yep, they'll eat it. It's the cleanup crew. <laughs> You just took the whole shell. Yep. So the, I'm just saying this to myself. Because, well. Too slow, Andy. Too slow. I already added my water to the instant pot. I feel like sometimes when you're cooking, you kind of just cook the same thing over and over, but diff just different. We got gravy, carrots, rice, and then we got our ham slash pork roast, whatever you want to call it for dinner. I hear Gina coming down the road. Let's see if she notices the door. Were you? I didn't know if you'd notice it or not. I had to get I had to get white trim paint to do the upstairs door. So I said, you know what? We're gonna have a bunch of leftover paint. We might as well do this door red and trim, paint the trim. I said that looks like looks didn't look good before. Do you want your gravy on the side, Olivia, or on your rice? I think we spotted Figaro's buddy right there. Woo! Woo! That's the one that scared me the other night. Mm. I thought something big His was staring at me. Yeah, they're glowing already. It has to be light. It scares me. I don't know where Figaro is. So I just picked the three winners for the 40,000 subscriber giveaway. The first place winner is Mark Small. Mark, you won the five-in-one propane chicken scalder. We have Neil Schwab. You won one of the herb books. And Lisa Green, you won the other one. I'm going to be emailing you guys. And then you can email me back with your contact information. Keep an eye in your email box. If you don't get it, look into your junk mail. I wanted to thank everybody for watching and thank everybody who signed up for the giveaway and we'll see you right back here tomorrow at Lumna Acres, the guide to modern homesteading, self-sufficiency, and freedom. Bye.